Congrats, you survived the night. Too bad that run didn't work out. Brecken is so desperate he's ready to deal with the devil himself, Rise. And since I'm supposed to determine whether or not Rice is the one who stole the GRE secret document, well, this is the perfect opportunity. What's the point of the airdrops? Rice takes everything away. Always check what's behind you. Crane, can you hear me? Jade? Yeah, I copy. Something wrong? No, no, it's him. Listen, Crane. We all appreciate what you're doing. And I know you're doing it to redeem yourself. Because Amir died saving your life. Look, I'm doing it because if we don't get antis in from Rice, people will start to die. You know, I met Amir right after the outbreak. I didn't know him for that long, but... He was the best, most decent man I've ever known. But I just want you to know that I don't blame you. Amir knew the risk. And Crane, we know that you too are taking a risk to do this for us. I... Look, Jade, we'll talk when I get back with the Antizen, okay? Okay. Just... Just come back in one piece, all right? You know, Alfie, right? He's our handyman. Sit in the workshop. Anderson? Forget about the drops and talk with Rice. You're Alfie? That's me. Electricity. Building maintenance. I keep this place running somehow. Glad you're here. I was just about to call you. What's the problem? Well, it's good news, bad news. The good news is that you restore the lights in the Cauldron District. The bad news is that it blew out the grid near the overpass. It's blacker than your pants pocket over there. So, do you need it switched back on? There are two substations. Flick, flick, you switch them on. The order doesn't matter. Then you throw the master in the main station, and it'll light up like a Christmas tree. I think I can do it. Of course you can do it. Any runner could do it. But there's a catch. Shutting off the lights has created a little black patch for the volatiles. Bunches of them are gathering there after sundown. So I've rigged a trap. It's already in place, all set to go. Now, if you can get in there and restore the power after it's dark, we can fry a whole lot of freaks in one shot. After dark? That's, that's gonna be a lot dicier. Sure. That's why no one's volunteered for this job. But I'm thinking maybe you're a bit tougher than the rest of these guys. Just an impression. Let's just say I'm here to help. Really? Good intentions, huh? Hope you've got some guts, or you won't last long.
Thanks, mate. You saved my sorry ass. It's Crane, right? Crane the big shot? Crane the superstar? You know what I think? I think Brecken blows your skills way out of proportion. You want something, pal? Yes. It drives me up the wall that people consider you to be the best runner in the tower. It's always been me. Volcan! Let's settle this once and for all. Show me what you've got, Crane. Prove you're faster than I am. Unless you're scared, are you? Karahim, I'm here. Make sure they see you and know who you are. You don't want to sneak up on them. That's a good way to catch a bullet. Wish me luck, kid. Good luck, brother. You're going to need it. Don't shoot! Don't shoot! I'm here to see Rice. Brecken sent me. Brecken? That asshole on the tower? All right. What does he want? Come to make a deal. What kind of deal? The kind I make with Rice, not with his flunkies. All right. Let him through. This ought to be entertaining. How long have we been friends, Osman? We have been friends for a very long time. That is why I'm so surprised that you would steal from me. Haven't I seen you somewhere before? Now I give you a choice. Very simple. Your right hand or your left. Left. <laughs> <laughs> 
Hmm. Was that my left or your left? You have the look of the tower about you. What do you want? I'm here to make a deal. A deal. For fantasy, no doubt. Desperate times. And what do you offer in return? Hmm? Your services? Your loyalty? Perhaps I should take both. Talk to Karim. He's one of ours. Do what he asks of you, and Rise will consider giving your people some antazin. Understood? I don't seem to have a choice. Perceptive. I met Rice, and Jade's right, he's a psychopath. He's also the GRE's rogue operative. Now I've got to cooperate with this piece of shit. Not only because of my mission, but also because he's got a ton of antizen stockpiled. I said you'd be coming by. I'm Karim. Crane. An American. I have an uncle there. Lives in Texas. You from Texas? You a cowboy? I'm from Chicago. Okay, Al Capone. We'll be in constant contact over the radio. That way I can make sure you get where you need to go. And where's that exactly? You're going to be climbing antenna towers and switching on shortwave radio modulators. Most of my men are too slow, too fat, or too drunk to climb a tower like that without killing themselves. If I do this, I'll get the antis in? That's between you and Rice. I know better than to speak for him. Just don't fail. He doesn't handle disappointment very well. You and I could be real good friends. Hey guys, look at this chicken shit. Just met a guy named Kareem. He's like Rice's major domo, I guess. Or number one flunky at the very least. Kareem's sending me to fix some antennas for Rice. Nothing better than being an errand boy.
Crane. Report. Just met Rise. There's no question, that's Suleiman. Guy's a psychopath. He's gone from ruthless politician to fucking warlord. Is he aware of your affiliation with us? No. He thinks I'm just a guy from the tower. In fact, he's making me jump through hoops before he'll give me any antizen. Acknowledged. Continue to do as he asks. Remember, we need that file. Great. Crane out. What exactly am I doing? Radio communication has been pretty spotty in the quarantine. These modulators will help boost the signal, so Rise can communicate with outposts at the far reaches of town. Well, that's a benefit for everyone, not just Rise. Perhaps, but the Emperor must monitor his empire. Kareem, I'm at the first antenna. If the power's not on, you'll have to turn it on. There'll be a switch in the small building at the antenna's base. Shouting because this fucked up infected motherfucker with guts hanging out of his mouth just spit a bunch of toxic snot at me. Not a bad reason.
gone. Good. Now head up to the top. Night's coming, guys. I repeat, the night's coming. Get back to the tower while you still can. Shit. Kareem, someone already scavenged this thing for parts. There's nothing up here to switch on. Fuck, I was afraid of that. All right, head to the next antenna tower. It's not too far from there. Just use the zip line and head east. You'll see it. What do I do if the second transmitter's trashed? The better question is, what will you do if you disappoint Rice? And the answer is probably, die horribly. This is Jade speaking. You know the drill. Get to the nearest safe house and wait until dawn. Good night. Good luck.
Jesus.